Tonight, there's more pushback over a proposed juvenile detention center in Isle of Wight County. Neighbors are making it clear they don't want it built near them. Now a group is coming forward in the search for solutions. Nico Clements has the story all new tonight. Pause. Don't make a decision right now. Concerns over a proposed juvenile detention center in Isle of Wight County are at an all-time high. I just wish there was other means of trying to rehabilitate the children. Tomorrow night, the Isle of Wight Board of Supervisors potentially voting to transfer 20 acres of property to the Department of Juvenile Justice for a 60-bed detention center. We are supposed to be rehabilitating children. Tonight in Newport News, the Rise for Youth Coalition discussed their plans to oppose the project as well as alternatives to youth prisons. Rise is a statewide juvenile justice reform initiative that believes prisons don't work for young people. Something is very wrong with a system that can continually lock up so many young people and they don't see a return on that lockup investment. Executive Director Valerie Slater says 40% of people who end up in secure care in Virginia come from Hampton Roads. She says sending young people away from their environment won't do them any good. What we build needs to be in the communities where these young people are coming from. Several alternatives discussed tonight. More counselors invest in a quality education system and more community-based programs. Why wouldn't we come right here to where the need is? There were many young people in the room and parents like Walita Hooker, who says pour resources into the communities, not prisons. Instead of putting detention centers up, have group homes. So, Nico, the vote on this is potentially set for tomorrow night. Yeah, David, the Board of Supervisors is holding a public hearing tomorrow night to discuss transferring that property to the Department of Juvenile Justice. Now, there was some discussion about postponing that vote until March 21st, but they also discussed taking action tomorrow night. So, David, we will see tomorrow.